It's been said that monastic life is the heart of the church and nestled in the rugged hills of northeastern Oklahoma. The heart of the church beats strongly at Our Lady of Clear Creek Abbey. A Benedictine monastery of the Congregation of Solem, the abbey is home to more than 40 monks. It is indeed the heart of the church for the good of the world. The monastery was founded in 1999 by 13 monks from Notre Dame de Fancambol Abbey in France. Eight of these were Americans who longed to return home and found a monastery in the United States. Invited by Bishop Edward J. Slattery to come to the Diocese of Tulsa, the monks arrived and in February 2000, the monastery was officially inaugurated as a priory. Since then, vocations have been flourishing. The original facilities quickly became too small for the growing community. So a new multi-story residence for monks and male guests was built in 2007. A Romanesque style church is now under construction and will be completed when funds are available. Now, 14 years after its founding, Our Lady of Clear Creek Abbey is seeing an extraordinary number of vocations requiring a plan for accommodating young monks. These men, mostly in their 20s and 30s, are attracted to the abbey because of the contemplative life according to the rule of St. Benedict. The monks do not engage in any activities outside of the abbey's property, devoting themselves instead to a life of liturgical prayer and manual work. In addition to the many hours of liturgies each day, the monks help support themselves by making their own habits and shoes, raising sheep and cattle, and cultivating their garden and orchard. The abbey produces cheese and also fabricates various wood and metal items in their workshops. Some of these items are for sale, like rosaries and furniture from local wood. The monks work with various conservation agencies and forestry management to develop their land. Most importantly, the Clear Creek monks pray not only for themselves, but for the world outside the abbey. At the center of their day is chanting the Liturgy of the Hours. Lexio Divina, a time of spiritual reading and private prayer. Their lives of liturgy and labor are in keeping with the Benedictine motto of Ora et Labora, prayer and work. Through their lives of prayer and work, the monks try to draw people closer to God. Growing numbers of families have relocated near the abbey to frequent the monastic mass and offices, and visitors come from around the world. The monks preach through the radical and evangelical witness of their very lives. At the February 2000 inauguration mass, Bishop Slattery addressed the monks. He said, that radical witness which you are called to give is what we mean by evangelization, but there can be no true evangelization without contemplation. And as Pope John Paul II reminds us, contemplation is the very heart of Benedictine life. Thus we who are in the world to evangelize it for Christ will depend upon the monks of this house. The monk will be the principal evangelizer of our communities and a new American civilization will be born. A civilization of love rooted in contemplation. I tell you that from this house, a new civilization will spring. Our Lady of Clear Creek Abbey, the heart of the church for the good of the world.